Brian's demonstrating our uh, cutter, which is cutting the um, foam into sections around the uh, templates. He's controlling the um, current by his transmitter. Got a receiver there, and he's got a meter to show us how much current is going through it. Which is a bit over an amp, isn't it? 1.7 1.7 amps is doing the job nicely. Yeah. He's cutting around oh. the template, cutting a square cut. Oh. Using the uh, hot wire bandsaw. The trick is not to put too much you force want. against the um, the card. The against the yeah against Template. the card. Yeah. Because the wire will will bow and it won't be cutting vertically anymore. Ah. So that bit's going to come out. There um, we go. So you can come back and catch up the bits of the yeah. lumpy bits. Yeah. See the green line there? That's the datum. We've lined the two templates up Five. on the datum. And now we're cutting around the larger of the two templates. So what we end up with is um, something like this. There's still another cut needed to do to get the angle between the two two templates, but it's pretty close. And that's where the electric potato peeler will come in. Yeah. So that will be our next cutting yep. implement. Yeah. Right. Let's we give it a try. Oh, because you've got a much shorter wire. Yeah. Must be. So you're having trouble getting it to... Getting yeah, point 0.8, that's it. That's the least I can do. Point 0.8 is, of an amp is the minimum current through the potato peeler end cutter. Yeah, we've also got some yeah. filler we can use if it's uh, deficient. Yeah. I figure if we're in within a millimetre, yeah, we're doing pretty you much. know, everything yeah. else is sandpaper finish. Yeah. Because last week I was trying to do it on this. Yes. And it was yeah. just a little bit awkward. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's it brilliant. It looks yeah. awkward, yeah. How it looks on, on the plan. So we've done the left hand side and we've gone between formers six and seven.